Welcome back to the channel. Today we take a look at the Panda Touch from Big Tree Tech. They reached out to me and asked if I wanted to test and review this. They did not sponsor this video, but they did send me the Panda Touch free of charge. They also agreed to allow me to give my honest opinion about this product, so here it is. While we opened the box, we found a sticker, manual, and a card to thank you for your purchase. While I pick up the screen for the first time, it has some weight to it, feels nice and it looks good while we explore further we find the USB cable A mounting bracket with a 3M sticker on the back. A hex key and four screws to attach it all. Now the best part in my opinion, a rubber ducky. I really like this one. We're putting it all together. Put the back plate on the mounting bracket. Use the two screws. I don't wanna let myself down, myself down And stick it on your printer Then try to find your USB port to put your USB cable in Change the switch to DC 5 volt And stick it on the back plate Simple as that, time to configure it. Choose your Wi-Fi, fill in your password. Give your printer a name, in my case I chose the original name, P1P. Next we fill in the printer IP. And the access code. Next will be our serial number. Make sure you don't miss any numbers like I did. And then you can put in your model name, in my case again, P1P. The rest of the information is optional. When you confirm, it is going to connect to your printer. This installation was easy, the only hard part was to get the USB cable in. Right out of the box it feels really responsive and all the menus are intuitive. All the menus are comparable with the X1C, you can attach a USB flash drive to it or access the files on the P1P and you can add more devices with the plus button. This feature alone would be a reason for me to buy this thing because you can control your AMS while standing with your printer without your computer being on. It is time to come to a conclusion and I will tell you my pros and cons. The price tag of 60 US dollars 
it's not much. It's a quick and easy install. No modifications of the printer is needed. It's a user-friendly interface. AMS units are compatible and you can hook up 10 printers at a time. You can monitor them and control them. Here are the cons. I could only find one. Future firmware updates of the Bamboo Lab printers could make this thing stop working. So after all this, it's time for my personal rating. I gave it 4.5 out of 5 stars. It's pretty damn good and I would definitely buy this. Thank you for watching, like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next project.